Hi, I'm going to show you a quick demonstration of XDoor, which is a simple and easy to use software for producing the machinings uh, in doors and linings, ideal for the composite door market. Uh, first of all, I'll show you just the door side, uh, and then in another video, I'll show you the doors and linings. First of all, click on New, and then in here I have three widths of templates made up. Let's just select the middle one. These are composite door sizes. First of all, give it a name. And that's the name the program will be. This is the size of the slab when it's starting. This is how we want to size it. So if this, uh, I can pick different options for sizing here. Let's say it's in field A and I'm going uh, clockwise round. The size I want of the door is going to be 800 wide and it's going to be 2 meters tall. What this has done down here now, because of, uh, this is set as a composite door one where a third can come off the top, so it's taking a third of the difference between the 2013 and the 2000 millimeters off the top and it's taking uh, the other whatever it is off the bottom uh, is dividing the 838 the difference between 838 and 800 by 2 so it's taking 19 mil off each side if I wanted to take a different setting off the top or off the top I could change the top and that will work out what it's taking off the bottom one there we're going to do a preformed door so in other words a bit like the little graphic on here where the door is already pressed so this is a composite type door so the, the pressings of the panels are already where they are plain or blank door would be if it was just a um, a, a flat door and maybe a cottage door as they call it in the composite market click along the bottom and that will then give us a representation of our door as it is at the moment the right hand click and then from here I can select what I want to put in here so in apertures if I've made all my apertures up and I'll show you in another video how we do these if I go onto here and I say I want the eclat arch and then I want the eclat mid apertures that will do for apertures uh, they're blank top so in a letter plate I want a blank top letter plate uh, we won't bother with the hinge rebates face rebates we'll go to hinges and in here we have a butt hinge that's 100 by 35 we'll go for that and then a door lock say the true lock Windsor if I click on the bottom refresh that is then putting those fittings into my door if I just uh, just make it so we can see through the door I've now got those fittings in here. I've got the lock which is a multi-point lock. I've got the two apertures or the, the two different styles of apertures on there. I've got a letter plate and I've got the hinges on the other side as, on there as well. If I'm happy with what I've got on there I just click on PGM to output the program uh, ready for machining. That's as easy as it is to actually output uh, or to, to produce a door from XDoor.